Hi everyone. Welcome back. I'm excited to see you again. Today we're going to read another one of my favorite stories. It's called White Rabbit's Color Book and it's written by Alan Baker. Let's see what happens with White Rabbit. One day, White Rabbit found three big tubs of paint. Red, yellow, and blue. Sunshine yellow, she thought. Lovely. A quick dip and... Yellow rabbit, bright as the sun. Now, what about red, thought rabbit. Into the red pot. What's this? Orange rabbit? Look, red and yellow together make orange. Time for a wash, thought rabbit. Into the shower. Red on its own this time. Splash. Red rabbit, sizzling hot red. How cool blue looks, thought rabbit. Red, yellow, and into the blue. Purple rabbit? Look, red and blue together make purple. I'm very important royal purple rabbit. Princess purple rabbit in the shower. Blue will do, thought rabbit. Blue rabbit, icy cold blue, brr. How warm yellow looks, thought rabbit. Back to the yellow. What do you think's gonna happen? Blue and yellow make green. What's this? Green rabbit. Look, blue and yellow together make green. Oh dear, no more water. All that's left is a little paint. Now what would happen? thought rabbit. Green rabbit into the red. Anyone know? Let's see. Hooray! Brown rabbit. Lovely warm brown. Blue, yellow, and red together make brown. And brown's just right for me. Now I'm going to show you how to do a fun little experiment. So your parents can look in the bottom to see some of the materials you'll need to do this experiment along with me. Hi, so now I'm going to show you how to do a really fun walking water rainbow experiment. And the, the colors are going to kind of hop just like White Rabbit did in the story. So all you need for this experiment are some cups that are all about the same size and fill them up with water almost to the top, but not quite. Then you're gonna need some six paper towels and you're gonna fold them into thirds. And you might need some scissors to cut them a little bit shorter. And you're gonna need some food coloring. Um, I already filled up my yellow cup because my yellow was a little dried up. So it actually it looks kind of orange, but that's okay. Um, and then you're gonna put your six cups in a circle, as you can see here, okay. And then in every other cup, you're gonna put the color, food coloring. So I have the yellow, I'm gonna skip a cup. I'm gonna put the red. And then I'm gonna put, skip a cup and put the blue. If you need more directions, your parent can Google um, walking water rainbow um, and find some more detailed directions. Then you're gonna take your paper towels um, and make sure they're all folded and you kind of want to measure 
to make sure that they don't stick up too high um, because it won't it won't work as well if they're too high so if you need to kind of cut it off um, and then I'm going to go ahead and top up the water cups so it's almost to the top Okay. And then you're going to take your six pieces of paper towels and you're going to put them over into the cup and you're going to watch the water is going to start to walk up the paper towel. Happens pretty fast if you fill them up high. And you're going to watch to see what happens to those empty cups of water. Yeah. You get a little closer. Oops. Can you see? The water is gonna walk from one paper towel and it's gonna start to mix. So you can try and do this on your own at home and watch the colors hop just like White Rabbit did in the story. I hope you have a lot of fun and um, come back for another story the next time.